General Irabo, who arrived at the NNS Delta headquarters in Wari, few minutes past eight in the morning, inspected the quarter guard while also meeting senior officers before embarking on a speedboat drive to the Focado's trunk line in Borutu. Fielding questions from journalists after several hours of inspection, the Chief of Defense Staff said the reduction in the pressure on troops is an indication that they're winning the war on all forms of criminality. So you know that truly we're winning the war. Why? The pressures that you talk about uh, compared to the past is not, it's not as much. And more so that um, you've seen reports of massive surrender of Boko Haram terrorists among other things. So that's an indication that, um, that we're winning the war. Um, you know, in no distant time, um, we will see the totality of the, of the end of uh, such kind of uh, criminality in, in that part of the country. On the purpose of his visit, he said it is to see the troops and the operational activities, which he said is yielding the desired results. And in this uh, Delta, for um, first to see the troops, and then to also go to the front lines to see some of the activities that they're undertaking. And just came back from um, um, one of the four operating bases, as it were, um, where they are having surveillance over the um, Focado, uh, trans Focado uh, trunk pipeline, which of course you know uh, the importance of it in the, less, in, um, the oil and gas uh, sector. So this is precisely why I'm here and uh, so far so good. I believe that um, in due course you will get to know that um, um, the troops are doing pretty well. The visit by the CDS will no doubt boost the operational capabilities of officers and men of the NNS Delta, led by the commander, Commander Abdul Hamid Babaino, and the Nigeria Army Sector 1 commander, led by Colonel Garuba. Delta State, Daily Fason, Galaxy News.